I'm Sabina Hasanova with the latest news in English on Asvision TV. President of Azerbaijan Ilham Aliyev received the Minister of Foreign Affairs of Gambia, Uzuno Dagbo. The delegation also included Gambia's Minister of Works, Transport and Infrastructure, Belamin Job. The head of state spoke highly of the friendly relations between the two countries and said that Azerbaijan and Gambia cooperate successfully and support each other within numerous international organizations. Mr. Darbo said that Gambia supports Azerbaijan's fair position on the Armenia-Azerbaijan Nagorno-Karabakh conflict and strongly condemns the occupation of Azerbaijan lands by Armenia. Over the past 24 hours, Armenian armed forces have violated the ceasefire along the contact line between Azerbaijan and Armenian troops 85 times, reports the Minister of Defense of Azerbaijan. The Defense Ministry also reports that the OSCE monitoring held on the border between Azerbaijan and Armenia today has passed without incidents. The monitoring was held under the mandate of the OSCE chairperson in office personal representative in Azerbaijan's Tartar district. Minister of Transport, Communications and High Technologies of Azerbaijan has completed all preparations to start issuing new identity cards, says Deputy Minister Elmir Velizadeh, hopeful that they will launch the new IDs very soon. We have scheduled it for January 1st next year. We have finished all the preparations. We have finished the infrastructure from our side of the project and are ready to implement it according to the plan. Through an electronic signature integrated into the ID, every citizen will be able to use electronic services of state structures. We now depend on the Ministry of Internal Affairs to launch the project. Baku celebrated the birthday of Her Majesty Elizabeth II, Queen of the United Kingdom of the Great Britain and Northern Ireland at a special reception. The British ambassador to Azerbaijan, Carol Crofts, addressed the participants praising the level of cooperation between the two countries. The participants watched a video showing the key events of the last year between Azerbaijan and Britain and enjoyed a beautiful concert. Minister of Energy of Azerbaijan Pervis Shahbazov congratulated the Queen and the British people and said UK remains the biggest investor in Azerbaijan's economy. Relations between Azerbaijan and the UK have been developing for 26 years on the basis of friendly and mutually beneficial cooperation. These ties include various fields, including energy and non-oil sectors. About 400 British companies operate in Azerbaijan. This collaboration has also played a significant role in implementing large-scale energy projects. I am confident that mutually beneficial and effective cooperation between the countries will continue in the future. Migration Service has launched a new e-service that will allow foreigners and stateless persons to check whether there is a ban to enter or leave Azerbaijan. One has to simply go to the service website and submit their data such as name, passport number, citizenship, etc. to find out if there is a ban. The Migration Service is motivated to continue working in order to increase user satisfaction and apply the latest innovations. And that was all for today from Asvision TV. Our next update will be on Monday. Have a nice weekend.